Reggae singer Jesse Royal is getting ready to drop his sophomore album, Royal, this June. In anticipation, he recently released his latest single, Rich Forever, featuring Dan Sol's self-proclaimed war boss, Vibes Cartel. Rich forever, rich with a loving family. Forever family, my treasure in a system that breathes the pressure, no release the tension. Every man for themselves, cheese intention, meaning brings that evil invention. Matter how me teach them, need detention, no humanity. According to a release, this cross genre collaboration between both artists unifies people's differences to support a common goal to be forever loyal and serves as a reminder of the internal strength and mental fortitude human beings possess, which prepares them for success in a society designed for their failure. Rich Forever is Produced by Ayata, she also worked on Protégé's Deliverance and Self-Defense, as well as Jazz Elise's After Three, featuring Mortimer. Royal, the album, comes through Easy Star Records and is currently on pre-release. And Sean Paul Coffey, Budja Banton and Usain Bolt will join Nicki Minaj and Rihanna for a fundraising effort for the ravished St. Vincent and the Grenadines. The Jamaican superstars, along with Dwayne Bravo, Alison Hines and Kez, will take part in a virtual fundraising concert to assist the volcano-ravaged St. Vincent and the Grenadines, SVG. The event is being put together by the Organization of Eastern Caribbean States. It is slated for the end of May, with 100% of the funds raised going to the SVG. A worthy cause indeed. Now, fans of musician Prince have taken over social media since the announcement that his estate is set to release brand new music this summer. The new Welcome to America CD marks the first time Prince's estate is releasing never-before-heard music from the megastar's famous Paisley Park Vault. The 12-track disc was recorded in 2010 to accompany a tour of the same name, but was never released. According to a statement from his estate, Welcome to America is a document of Prince's concerns, hopes, and visions for a shifting society, presently foreshadowing an era of political division, disinformation, and a renewed fight for racial justice. The estate plans to debut the new music in July, five years after his death. I'm Deidre reporting for E-Prime.